have a plan for creating a cleaner, safer environment in your facility? Ultraviolet light may be a game changer. Ultraviolet light is nothing new, but it may be new to many industries outside of healthcare, and it could be a powerful tool in the fight against COVID-19. Scientists have known about the disinfectant powers of UV light for more than a century. There are three different groups of wavelengths within the spectrum, UVA, UVB, and UVC. The sun produces the full range of ultraviolet. UVA and UVB rays hit the Earth's surface from the sun and are known for causing sunburns, but UVC rays cannot penetrate the Earth's atmosphere. When we're talking about germicidal UV, or the wavelengths that can kill pathogens, we're primarily talking about UVC. Germicidal UV can stop DNA and RNA in viruses, bacteria, mold, and fungus from replicating. Most products have a 99.9% .9 kill rate or higher. Scientists have already started testing its ability to inactivate SARS-CoV-2, and preliminary results show it does inactivate the virus that causes COVID-19 but UV does come with some side effects and warnings. UVC can damage our skin and eyes, so many products cannot be used while anyone is around. UV light cannot penetrate any dirt or dust on a surface, so it doesn't completely replace cleaning. Rays from UV follow a line of sight rule. They only hit surfaces in their direct path. You may need to run multiple cycles to disinfect an entire room. There are five different applications of UV, and even though we'll walk through them individually, it might be best to use a combination to properly disinfect your building. Let's start with upper air units. These units emit UV rays above your head. Because the UV is targeted at air in the upper area of rooms, the units can run constantly, even in crowded areas. A second application is UV fixtures for HVAC equipment. Installing UV lamps on HVAC coils or in ducts can disinfect the air circulating in a building. An added bonus, the UV lights also help keep the HVAC system cleaner. Next, we have UV fixtures that target surface disinfection. There are several options in this category and they all function a little differently. You can install or mount fixtures that run on a timer or with a switch but most of these fixtures use UVC and target surfaces in a room, so they should only be turned on when no one is around. Another fixture option uses UVC between 208 and 222 nanometers, called far uvc Scientists have started to focus on this technology and found that it can disinfect, but is not harmful to skin and eyes. That means the fixtures can run constantly. There are several far UVC options available like this downlight, which can be installed over high touch areas like sinks, counters, or ATMs. A fourth option is mobile UV units. Mobile units give you great flexibility. You can move them from room to room as needed, but they require labor, and they may require multiple cycles to ensure UV rays hit all surfaces. Hotels, hospitals, and schools are excellent applications for these units. And last, handheld and portable units. These are ideal for small personal devices or limited surfaces. One option is a tabletop fixture. You turn it on and leave the room. Many smaller units like this do not have a very far reach, but can result in high levels of disinfection on nearby surfaces. Or you could consider a UV wand like the blade. It quickly disinfects hard to clean surfaces but beware of similar products with a low cost point. They may not deliver the disinfection promised. Another option is a bag like this tote. You place your personal items inside and they are disinfected in under three minutes. To test whether or not a UV fixture is giving you the coverage you want, you can use a card called a dosimeter. The center circle changes color based on the dose of UV received. When handled properly, UV products can be a safe and effective way to disinfect air and surfaces. For more resources and links to products, head to regencylighting.com.